A South Houston woman says she believes prostitution has been happening for months right in front of her house in a portal potty. She reached out to ABC 13 for help after not getting the answer she wanted from her councilwoman. Now, while talking to our Derek Lewis today, she noticed a crew showed up to clean things up out there, but that was after ABC 13 made some calls. Here's his story tonight. On the outside, it looks like a normal spot for someone to use the restroom. But inside prostitution and drugs in the porta potty. Priscilla Jackson says the porta potty was placed here in December when construction started on this home on Nathaniel Brown Street. She noticed people using it at night. I could see them going in. I could really see them going in and I could see them coming out. But what really threatened me the most was that it was at night late at night. Jackson says building the new home has also come with trash, food, water bottles and more building up for weeks. She made calls to have things cleaned up but kept getting the runaround. Jackson says she also reached out to our councilwoman, Carolyn Evans Shabazz, for weeks, trying to get some answers about when this would get cleaned up. ABC 13 spoke to someone in her office about the problem Monday but didn't hear back. I feel violated. I really feel violated because no one should have to live <clears throat> in filth like this. On Tuesday, the porta potty was removed and a crew showed up to clean up the trash. They're coming to clean it up. Oh, look, they're coming to clean it up. The builder of the home did not want to talk, but his workers tell me they got a call this morning to get the job done. Jackson doesn't like that she had to go this far to get something done, but she says if you are having an issue and not getting answers, don't give up. Look what happened today. Uh, they're doing something. 